Hello, I just received an email from a client and they're working on their one thing plan or their strategy. And he asked me an interesting question. He was looking for some input and he asked me would I review the goals and things they'd written and so on. And I did. Now specifically, they wanted input on their big, hairy, audacious goal, Jim Collins's concept, the, the mission. And it struck me that they'd fall in the trap, a trap that many people fall into. And I want to explain it to you here. I want you to imagine an X, Y axis. And this X axis here is the size of your thinking. How big is your thinking? And the Y axis here is the amount of effort that you put in. The size of your box, the consequent box, is a function of your thinking. So, small thinking, a lot of effort, there's the size of your box. Big thinking, same effort, much bigger box, much bigger outcome. And I'd argue to you that the quality of your thinking, the size of your thinking, the size of the goals and objectives that you set yourself defines the outcome, not the time and effort. Time and effort, I would argue, is constant. That's if you set bigger goals, bigger objectives, you just do bigger things, different things to achieve them. So think about this. How big is your box? How big is your thinking? I think it's a critical issue when you're establishing uh, your goals and objectives, particularly your big, hairy, audacious goal. Don't fall the trap of thinking small. Think big.